Printing infringement letters. There are two ways to print infringement letters. Letters can be printed for an individual driver day or for a whole range of dates and drivers. Please note, letters can only be printed from the Taco Master website and not the Taco Master client. To print infringements for one worker for one day, this is the procedure. From the worker calendar, click on the day with the infringement from either the Tachograph or WTD tab. From the Tachograph day view, scroll down to the infringement in the events list. When you mouse over the infringements, the infringement type text becomes underlined. Click on this text and then choose Print Letter. All infringements for that worker for that day will be printed and the letter's print log will be affected and the lead time report will show that the letter was printed or reprinted on this day. To print a wider range of infringement letters for your entire company, site or other filters, mouse over Reports and Driver Reports on the main website menu. Click on Infringement Letters. This report is selected between two dates. Click on the calendar date icons and select from and to dates or type in the dates using either hyphen or a forward slash. If you are printing infringements for a specific agency, choose the agency of leave as all. Select department or leave as default for all. Only departments available to your login will be available. Select employee type, either permanent, agency, casual or all. You may have marked some workers as left in the Edit Worker section. Click on the Include Workers that have left the company and any infringements for these left drivers will be included. Show charts for infringements. When checked, this will show a linear colour-coded chart for each infringement with brackets around the section where the infringement occurred. Show the breakdown of events for each infringement. With this item checked, if an EU driver's hours break infringement has occurred, the letter displays a list of events from the workers' or drivers' modes. These events will be shown as D for drive, W for work, A for periods of availability, R for rest. If a period of rest is 15 minutes or longer, it would be underlined as it may qualify as a break that could have been valid. Show day detail at the top of each letter. When checked, a summary is produced at the top of each letter to show a breakdown of each day in the selected date period. Display in black and white to produce the report in black and white for mono printers. Include digital EU infringements. When checked, all EU drivers' hours infringements will be included on the letter. Include analog chart infringements to include the analog center field infringements. Include a copy of analog charts. If a driver incurs an infringement using an analogue chart, you can include a copy of the chart as part of the letter print, and if you want the back of the chart included, then also check Include copy of back of analogue charts. You can only print a copy of the back of the charts if the front is checked as well. If you do print charts with letters, you are likely to use up quite a lot of ink. Include speeding infringements to include digital speed infringements. This is not available for analogue charts. Digital speed infringements are where a vehicle has been driven over the tachograph calibrated maximum is not related to road speed or location. There is a company setting for your Taco Master administrators that can set the minimum speeding time. The default is 60 seconds, but can be set to lower or higher. All tachograph speeding events below this time will be ignored. Include WTD infringements. Include all working time infringements. This is any infringement related to working time and road transport directive. Include manual infringements and warnings. If you have created and used any manual infringements, these can be included on the infringement letter. Manual infringements can be set up for any non-TACO or working time related infringements. Show points. If you are using the TACO Master infringement waiting point system, these can be related to DCRS points too. Then these points values can be printed on the infringement letter with this option checked. Sort by site. If you are printing letters for all of your available sites, this option will collate your letters into groups of driver from each site. Reprint previously printed infringements. If an infringement had previously been included on a letter, it will not print on any other letter unless this option is checked. 
Include letters printed but not acknowledged. If you use the Taco Master Letter Acknowledgement System, this can be selected by your Taco Master administrators in company settings. You can use this option to show include infringements that have not yet been marked as acknowledged. Show potential roadside penalties. The Driver and Vehicle Standards Authority have a published set of graduated fixed penalty amounts that can be levied to a driver at the roadside should he or she be stopped and an infringement found. This setting allows you to show a driver what could be charged to them should they be stopped. Dry run. Enabling this will not make a record of the letters being printed. If you wish to see what infringement letters would be printed, use this option. The letter does not have the run and letter ID numbers with the driver name and should not be used as the letter to be signed by the driver and manager for your records. Site. Choose a specific site to print letters for or leave as all for all sites that you can access with your login. Supervisor. If a worker has a specific supervisor, you may call Supervisor Team Manager or something similar, selected in the worker details. This can be used to filter which workers are included. If you do not use Supervisor or want to print every driver, leave as all. The workers or drivers can be selected by all, a range or a single driver. Should you wish to print all workers based on the criteria already selected, leave these fields as blank. To include workers who have been marked as left in the worker record, click the Include Left Workers. To produce a letter for a single worker, start typing any part of the worker name and any worker with those letters will automatically appear. Click on the correct driver. Should you wish to print a range of drivers, type in the first and last worker surnames you wish to include and all workers in that range would be included. Once you have selected all of your required criteria, click View Report. A new browser tab will be opened and all of the letters within the range you have selected will be generated. The browser tab will display the percentage completed and you will see the names of the workers being processed. Do not be alarmed if you see workers not related to your site. All drivers are checked for any duties which may relate to your site. This report will then generate a PDF file containing letters to any workers that have had infringements over the period you specify, which can be opened or downloaded. Even if you do not send the results to a printer, the Taco Master system counts this as a printed set of letters unless dry run was selected. Once a letter has been printed, the display of the day in the worker calendar is changed and an envelope icon appears in the top right corner of the day. The day view is also changed. An envelope icon appears on the infringement event line. The group calendar display is also changed once an infringement is printed. A green corner icon is displayed to show print has been done for this infringement. If you wish to reprint a letter for a worker, you can repeat the process covered in this tutorial, remembering to use the Reprint Previously Printed Infringements option or you will not see old infringements. It is also possible to reprint infringements from the Worker Summary page. Click View Letter from the Letters Printed section. Road Tech. Innovate. Integrate. Secure.